the UJ2 here. Welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Union Cross. <sighs> Can you believe it? I actually have a behemoth, an Omega behemoth at level 10. That's crazy, man. Anyway, uh, that's not what we're here for. This is what we're here for right now. Kaboom. So, uh, get dual wield Roxas EX. Actually, you know what? Before I start reading this, let's check this out. Okay, get dual wield Roxas EX pre-strengthened to three special attack dots within 20 draws from the latest EX metal deal. Um, starting tonight. At midnight. PT. <laughs> Plus, the December Coliseum update is here with festive spirit packs and a new skill. Okay, um, I don't think it's going to be AB5 max. It's a brand new skill, so I'm thinking we might see on the DB side, or we might see a, um, uh, what's it called? I don't know. I don't know. Um, <clears throat> but okay, uh, dual wield rocks. Okay, dual wield rocks is, is, he's a metal. He's quite a metal. Let me look it up here really quick, exactly what he does. Um, because I remember a while back, um... Me and Proper were talking, and we were talking about what the next metal worth pulling would be for. And actually, this was before K. Uh, was this before Kyrie X came out? I don't know. But anyway, uh, dual wield Roxas. He's reverse power. He deals six hits for two turns, raises reverse strength by two tiers, power strength by uh, seven tiers, lowers target defense by two tiers, power defense by two tiers, and inflicts more damage to higher your HP. Okay. <coughs> So, um, he is our first metal that's going to raise reversed uh, metals power. Um, that in itself right there is pretty special. I mean, that's pretty unique. We haven't had anything like that yet. But it doesn't generally buff up. And as a lot of us know, and I'm sure you guys know, there is a Kyrie style metal already in JP, which more than likely we will be seeing it sooner than later. So, the other thing to talk about here is the 20 pull mercy. So this is a 20 pull mercy. 20. 20. Um, man, 20 pull mercy. <sighs> That's a lot of money, guys. That's a lot of money right there. Um, I'm actually... I'm, I'm probably going to go into this a little more in the future, and I already have kind of talked a little bit about it, just how I feel about, you know, the polls and everything. And I know a lot of people right now are saying it's too soon, it's too much, you know, we, we can't, we just got out of the Foretellers, and right before the Foretellers, we had the first um, Kyrie EX, and now we have her again. Um, so, yeah, it's begging us for mercy. It's kind of funny how it doesn't say mercy anymore. Within 20 draws now. Um, 20 draw EXs. It's it's just a lot, guys. It's really a lot. I mean, if you really want to continue being competitive in the game, unless you have a rather large amount of money to spend in the game, I really do think that it's time to... You know what? It is time. It's time to really start analyzing what is coming in JP, seeing what they get, how they get it, and from there deciding what is worth saving for or not. Um, especially metal wise. I mean, for me right now, I can't pull for this. Um, would I like to pull for it? Of course, it'd be wonderful to pull for this, but I can't pull for it. Um, same with the, uh, with other future, well, you know, we'll talk about the other ones later. Anyway, but pretty cool. If you've been waiting for dual wheel Roxas, um, definitely a metal that can, that will do some ridiculous damage. I mean, seriously, look at that. Uh, deal six hits for two turns, raises reverse strength by two tiers. Can you imagine getting double cast or, or copying this metal? Uh, raises power strength by seven tiers, lowers targets defense by two tiers, power defense by two tiers, for more damage to higher your HP. Very, very powerful. Very powerful metal. Uh, again, the only thing it's missing is that seven, um, you know, getting you to the seven in general, uh, general strength. Um, but we have a lot of other metals that can do that, including one of the high score challenge right now. Uh, so anyway. Good luck if you're going to be pulling for him. 
uh, and congratulations if you get him. The other thing is the Coliseum. Of course, Coliseum is ending tonight. I I will not be in the top 10,000. Um, my personal goal right now is just to break into tier 15. Um, I believe I can do it. And I believe I can actually go a little bit into tier 15, which is going to be a personal best for myself. And I'm going to be very happy for that. Um, but I am not going to be able to push further than that. Uh, so that means I will not be getting the Second Chance 3, which is a beautiful medal that I know a lot of people are really going to enjoy. But Second Chance 2 does trigger a lot for me, so I don't feel it's that much of a loss right now. But, you know, it would have been nice to have it. Of course, we're probably going to have one pretty soon, huh? <laughs> in an avatar board uh the other thing is we are getting the reindeer parts that's pretty cool actually it's really awesome we're getting the reindeer parts um and it looks like it's going to be part of coliseum which is really awesome if these reindeer parts are parts of coliseum i'm really looking forward to putting that christmas hat on my pig it'll be very fun those eyebrows too actually you know what the can we do the eyebrows and the, the beard Hmm. We'll have to see. But anyway, I'm going to leave it there, guys. Thank you very much for watching. As always, I am DUJ2. Uh, I'm going to keep, I think, pushing in Coliseum a little bit, trying to get into Tier 15, personal best for myself, and doing some other stuff in the game. But yeah, uh, let's check real quick to see if there's anything else. Um, nope. All right. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I'll see you guys next time. See ya.